Now well, I've got to change my igniter on my Englander. Uh, this is my 25 PDV. It's the one that heats 2200 square feet. And this one is, I want to say now, it's probably about eight years old. Um, but the um, igniter stopped working. It was, it was having trouble working. I had to put the pellet right in, the wood pellet all the way in the hole for it to light. This is the new one. So um, to change this, I already took the back off, which was real easy. Those are just these little bolts, these little, um, these little screws. Took all those off. And then the uh, igniter, igniter's right there. And you can see that there is a bolt that needs to be unscrewed, and then the igniter will pull out. And the igniter has wires that just run here to the panel. So pretty straightforward. So what I'm going to do... See how this goes. So I've got the, I've got the uh, igniter. This is the old igniter still in there. And here I have a 5 16 open end wrench. And I'm just going to undo that. And here it comes. Got the old one out. And the old one's got a little bit kind of it's really sunken in there, so that's probably why it wasn't working. There's the new one. And and to turn it, see if I can get it to go in the hole. Just so I don't like the fit. Alright, so I just I got the grinder out. And I started working on this. Okay, that's pretty good. Okay, that's the new one. Now after I did the grinding, you can see it goes in just a little bit further than the other one. So I wanted to make sure I got that pushed all the way as, as deep as I could get it. So I don't have to put the pellets in there. Alright, so I've got it. It's in there pretty far. Uh, now I'm just going to take the Five sixteenths wrench. I'll tighten this thing down my hand first. All right, here's the moment of truth. Got this looking in here. Hit the on button, and we're gonna wait for that coil to light up. And I also replaced one of the auger motors, so the lower auger now is spinning. Uh, but let's give this a couple minutes and see if this thing will light up. This is great. So this, it's actually, it started. Um, it was just enough time for me to put the tools into the garage, and this thing is going and just lit like crazy. The old one never did that at all. We had to sit there and move the pellets away, and, uh, you know, just it, it just took forever until it finally died and now this brand new one is rocking and rolling lit it in no time probably three minutes great stuff